peppermint mocha, one of the classic favorite coffee flavor. For those without access to commercial peppermint syrups, you can make your own homemade peppermint syrup the easy way. You may use fresh peppermint leaves, pure peppermint extracts, or simply peppermint tea bags. In this video clip, I will be showing you how to make easy homemade peppermint syrup using peppermint tea. The ingredients are sugar, water, and peppermint tea bags. For the proportions that I will make, I will be using 5 tea bags. The more you use, the stronger the taste and smell of your resulting syrup will be. We will start by making our concentrated sugar syrup. Concentrated sugar syrup means two parts sugar to one part water. This way, when you use the syrup to mix with your drinks, you only need to use a small portion. Bring the water to a boil. Add the sugar. You may simply wait for the sugar to dissolve on its own or stir to dissolve. You may multiply the proportions in this recipe for larger batches. I tend to make them in small batches as they are easy enough to make. Once you are sure the sugar is fully dissolved, turn off the heat. Pour the concentrated sugar syrup into a jar and steep the tea bags in. I would steep it for at least two hours to allow the tea to fully infuse with the syrup. Be sure to infuse the tea bags in whilst the syrup is still hot. I would not recommend boiling the tea bags with the syrup. There is absolutely no need for that as the tea bags will simply absorb your syrup. After a couple of hours, take off the tea bags. It is smelling rather nice that kind of reminds me of peppermint toothpaste. Refreshing. Let me give it a quick taste. Sweet and minty. What you have here is a homemade syrup that smell and taste of peppermint that is perfect to both sweeten and flavor your drinks. Because these are natural, we will not get a greenish color. If you plan to sell as bottled syrups, you might wish to add a bit of green coloring. For home and shops, I would suggest you stop here. This syrup should last for at least two weeks refrigerated. Now let's apply it on a drink. I'm going to make hot peppermint cocoa using this presser machine. We need hot water to dissolve the cocoa. Two tablespoons of cocoa powder. I'm using my blend of unsweetened dark chocolate here. And two tablespoons of our freshly made peppermint syrup. Whisk to combine well. I'm using a matcha whisk here, which is really useful not only for matcha, but also for chocolate powder. Steam the milk. And pour the milk over the cocoa mix. Add a large marshmallow on top. And we have a hot peppermint cocoa using our homemade peppermint syrup. Enjoy! Next time you have a craving for peppermint mocha, get those peppermint tea bags ready. Thank you for watching. Ciao for now.